let's compare the fraction 4 sevenths to the fraction 5 sevenths. And what I want you to do right now is to pause this video and think about which of these fractions represents a larger quantity. I'm assuming you've had a go at it, and the one thing that might jump out at you is that they both have the same bottom number, which we call the denominator. They both have a denominator of 7. So one way to think about it, this is literally 4 sevenths. This is literally 5 sevenths. So we could rewrite 4 sevenths as literally 4 times 1 seventh. And we can rewrite 5 sevenths as literally 5 times 1 seventh. It's 5 sevenths. 5 sevenths. So now if I have 4 of something versus 5 of something, which is going to be a larger quantity? Well, clearly, 5 of this 1 7th is going to be more. So 4 7ths is smaller, 5 7ths is larger. And so what we can do is we can write a less than symbol. And the way that I remember less than and greater than is that the point, the small side of the symbol, always is on the same side as the smaller number. So this could be read as 4 7ths is less than 5 7ths, or that 4 times 1 7th is less than 5 times 1 7th. Now let's do another scenario, but instead of having the same denominator, let's have the same numerator. So let's say we want to compare, let's say we want to compare 3 fourths versus versus 3 versus 3 over, let's say versus 3 over 9. Which of these two fractions is a larger number. And once again, pause the video and try to think about it on your own. Well, as we, as, as we mentioned, we don't have the same denominator here. We have the same top number instead. Here was the same bottom number, same denominator. Here we're going to have the same numerator. We have the 3 right over there. And we could view 3 fourths as literally 3 times 1 fourth. And we could view 3 ninths as literally 3 times 1 ninth. 3 times 3 times 1 ninth. So we have 3 fourths and we have 3 ninths. So we really just have to think about what's larger, a fourth or a ninth? Well, think about if you start with a whole, think about starting with a whole like this. Think about starting with a whole. Let's draw a, f and let me make a hole right over here. A hole right over here. So the same sized hole. A fourth is literally taking the whole and dividing it into four pieces, while a ninth is taking the whole and dividing it into nine. Nine equal sections, I could say. So let's divide this into four equal sections. So my best attempt to hand draw equal sections. So that's two equal sections, and then that looks pretty close to four equal sections. So that right over there is one fourth. And let me draw ninths here. So let me first split this into three equal sections. So those would be third, and then split each of those into three equal sections. So this is my best attempt at that, at hand drawing nine equal sections, splitting the whole into nine equal sections. So when you see here, and you might have already realized this, if you divide something into four equal sections, each section is going to be bigger than if you divide it into nine equal sections. A ninth is smaller than a fourth. A ninth is smaller than one fourth, so three ninths is going to be smaller than three fourths. So once again, when you want to do less than or greater than, you would want to put the point, the small side of the symbol, on the same side as a smaller number. So it would look like this. And this is the greater than symbol because you're literally, what you have on the left is the larger number. 3 fourths is greater than 3 ninths. And if you actually wanted to represent not just 1 fourth and 1 ninth, we could actually color it in. 3 times 1 fourth, well that's 1, 2, 3. While 3 times 1 ninth or 3 ninths is 1, 2, 3. And when you look at it that way, it's pretty clear. But the, uh, the important thing to realize is, is that when the denominator is larger, when the denominator is larger, you're dividing the whole into more pieces, so each piece will be smaller. So making the denominator larger makes the fraction smaller. Making the numerator larger makes the fraction larger.